All right, guys, what is going on? We're back with some more Miami Heat, my GM, and this is our monthly review. We're going to be taking a look at the month of November. We got a couple days of August, October in there, but really, it's we're just focusing on November. Uh, we did terrible. Uh, we are ninth seed in the conference, second in our division, but really, that's not nothing to be happy about. We lost Bosch. Josh Richardson is about to come back. I gave him like, like two days. Um, so, I mean, nothing really, like, the Bosch injury was, was tough. We were doing pretty good. Uh, he got injured, I believe, like, the second game, not the second game, the third game. We um, we lost the second game by one point, which we played here on the channel. Then he got injured in the Spurs game, so we really only had him for two games. That sucks. Uh, so our next game that we're actually going to play on this channel will be Cavaliers, October. December 9th, actually, that'll be an interesting game. So now we're look. Let you see our we're second in the division. We're behind the Atlanta Hawks for 11 and 5. I don't see us catching them for at least like a month. The conference we're ninth. The Cavaliers have only lost one game. Oh my gosh, that game against them in our next episode is gonna be tough. That's that's rough. I don't know how we're gonna beat them, but yeah, that's that's pretty tough to look at. Boston Celtics doing pretty good. We're only one game behind the Detroit Pistons. Uh, in the win column, we both lost 10 games. So I think we might be... I think this year, anyway, I was thinking we only might make like the 7th or 8th seed. Uh, I didn't really think we were going to do too great, to be honest. Uh, just didn't think so. But uh, yeah, Chris Bosh is out with a hyperextended right shoulder. Josh Richardson is out day to day with a bruised hip. Um, that's tough on us, man. And now, we're going to go look at some trades. I was just looking around here. Chris Bosh, before he got injured, we had, like, two trade offers from the Raptors trying to give us Kyle Lowry. So, if when Chris Bosh comes back healthy, what do you guys think about that? We looked at some Dion Waiters trades because Dion Waiters... Out of all of our shooting guards we have, he has been the worst. Uh, that's just, so. We looked at a lot of trades for him. Didn't really see much that I liked. So we'll, well, I guess we'll hold on to him for a little bit longer. Now we're looking at trades for Wayne Ellington. The Jared Bayless trade would be nice, but I don't want to give up a draft pick. Uh, nothing else really. The Tiago Splitter trade would be nice. We need a backup behind. Uh, some by side because coming off the bench, we do have a lot of power fours. None of them that are tall enough really to play center because we've got guys like Derek Williams and Josh jo with something Johnson. I forget his name already. So not really nothing that I would want to play at center. So if we can find a replacement backup center, that'd be one thing that I look forward to this season. So that is going to be it for our monthly review. This was November, the first month of the regular season. Uh, next month will be December, so after December, after we play our two to three games in each month, we'll do our monthly reviews. That's going to be it for me. Make sure to like button, subscribe if you're a Miami Heat fan, because this is my GM. It's going to last a couple seasons. That's what I planned on. So uh, like, subscribe, and comment. I am out. Thank you so much for watching.